O God, we dare not place our hope in you, because we have no hope to place. We have forgotten mercy like the dew. We have lost sight of days of grace. Our heart's bowl brims with hollow emptiness. Our dreams have vanished like the smoke of incense burned to gods of faithlessness upon an altar stone that broke. O God, you have stirred up the darkened heart with promises of light to come. The embers of our cold heart shift and start a flicker that may yet become. The fire we fear because we shy from burns, our soul once suffered at the hands of our own treachery if life returns. For us, we dread rebirth's demands. O God, ignore our plea for cold despair, its ashes undisturbed, its chill, unwarned by any hint borne on the air by unseen angels crying still, that promises are kept, grant us instead, that small perturbing flick of flame that wakens even the living dead, just hope enough to call your name. Psalm 42 a thirst is my soul for the living God. When shall I go and behold the face of God? A thirst is my soul for the living God. When shall I go and behold the face of God? As the hind longs for the running waters, so my soul longs for you, O God. A thirst is my soul for the living God. When shall I go and behold the face of God? Send forth your light and your fidelity. They shall lead me on and bring me to your holy mountain, to your dwelling place. A thirst is my soul for the living God. When shall I go and behold the face of God? Then will I go to the altar of God, the God of my gladness and joy. Then will I give you thanks upon the harp, O God, my God. A thirst is my soul for the living God. When shall I go and behold the face of God? I know well the plans I have in mind for you, says the Lord. Plans for your welfare, not for woe. Plans to give you a future full of hope. When you call me, when you go to pray to me, I will listen to you. When you look for me, you will find me. Yes, when you seek me with all your heart, you will find me with you, says the Lord. And I will change your lot. I will gather you together from all the nations and all the places to which I have banished you, says the Lord, and bring you back to the place from which I have exiled you. Even in the darkness that lies between despair and hope, we dare to pray. O God, our Savior, you are the hope of all the earth. O God, our Savior, you are the hope of all the earth. O God, when hope flickers and faints, rekindle within us the fire of your Spirit that we may burn with desire for your promised salvation. O God, our Savior, you are the hope of all the earth. 
O God, when despair overtakes the human spirit, fan in us the desire to pray that we may find in your fidelity the source of all true hope. O God, our Savior, you are the hope of all the earth. O God, when the darkness threatens those who have forgotten your goodness in the past, stir once again the memory of grace, that remembering we may dare to hope once more. O God, our Savior, you are the hope of all the earth. At this time, I would ask you to remember someone you know that is dis maybe despairing or in need of hope. And lift that name up to the Lord right now. Hear all these prayers in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ. Let us pray. It is you, O Lord, who are my hope, my trust, O Lord, since my youth. On you I have leaned from my birth. From my mother's womb you have been my help. My hope has always been in you. When my strength fails, do not forsake me. But be my hope through Jesus Christ our Lord, the promised hope of all the world. Amen. <laughs> 